Hey guys, what's up? Spenny here, bringing you a really quick Palantir video. Um, ARK Invest put in about $30 million into the stock today, so I want to give you a quick update on that. Um, in the ARK K fund, you can see here 1.2 million shares, so that is around $30 million plus dollars. Uh, quite a big purchase all at once for even ARK. Um, definitely a bullish sign. Uh, Palantir has been getting hit really hard today. Uh, if we look at the ARK fund and actually see how many shares ARK is holding now, they have over 10 million shares worth $251 million. Definitely a nice sign that they are buying at these prices. However, the stock is definitely in a downtrend right now and you can never really know for sure when that trend is going to reverse. Um, I'm going to show you guys the chart a little bit. You know, it's not the greatest, I gotta admit. Um, this isn't my illustration, but this is from TradingView. Somebody here has drawn a few places of support and put a stop loss at $20. So this person put the support at $23. He was anticipating that the stock was gonna bounce off that, go higher, and his target zone was around $38. Now, this is really speculative. Um, it's a really hard way to trade. Um, we've actually broke below $23 now. And that's just the nature of the trend. Um, I'm going to show you guys a few things on why the trend is going down. So as you can see here, we closed at $21.88. And the thing is, we broke below support of around that $23 to $22. There should be buying pressure between $20 to $23. Um, this is a place of support. However, if the trend is down, you know, we can definitely break below that. And right now, the entire stock market basically is getting hit really hard. So I don't care how much support you have. I mean, it can definitely break through that, no problem. And another thing to note here is we're below our 50 day moving average by quite a bit. And we're actually below our 200 day moving average. And that's really bad. That is basically you're fighting gravity now. Uh, breaking below both of our moving averages is gravity pushing you down. So really, I wouldn't be surprised if we see a little bit more pain. However, it's really simple. If you're already invested in this stock, it's the absolute worst time to sell. If you're a long-term investor like myself or Kathy Wood, you just keep on buying the dip. You know, There's a reason why Kathy Wood is buying the stock right now because long-term, the stock is looking very attractive at these prices. And so I see it as a buying opportunity for anybody who's invested in the stock and wants to bring down their average cost. However, where it gets tricky is if you're not yet invested in the stock, then you gotta make the decision, do you enter now or do you wait? Personally, the way I usually play it, if the stock is in a strong downtrend like it is right now, I will throw in about 30% of what I want to enter with. And then if the stock continues to go down, now I have some skin the game and I will dollar cost average as it goes down. Or if it goes back up, I will dollar cost average on the way up. But the key thing is, is just to get skin in the game. Otherwise, you'll sit on the sidelines and you'll risk never actually getting in at a decent price. And right now, we are definitely trading at a decent price. Um, just the whole market right now is getting really shook up. You guys all know the Warren Buffett quote. I know I don't need to say it, but be fearful when others are greedy and be greedy when others are fearful. Right now, people are, you know, very fearful and it's time to be greedy. Palantir is on a discount. Um, so I'm definitely looking to add more shares here. But yeah, guys, just a quick update for you. Uh, definitely make sure to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more Palantir updates like this. Drop the video a big thumbs up if you liked it and I'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you.